Hi, my name is Keith Hall. Welcome to another NASC Minutes. If you watch the NASC Minutes uh, a lot, you'll hear me talk a lot about retirement plan contributions. Uh, you can look at me, obviously it's gonna be more important for me to think about retirement, uh, but let's not talk about age right now. Uh, the key point that I'm gonna talk about today is the difference between a Roth IRA and a traditional IRA. Uh, I get lots of questions from small business owners about which is better, which should I do? So before we get into the detail, I, I want to tell you, doesn't matter which one you do, do one of them. Start saving for your retirement, find some way to put some money away every year. And when you're my age, you'll be happy that you did. So let's get into the detail a little bit. Now the key concept is a Roth IRA does not provide a current tax deduction. A traditional IRA does provide a current tax deduction. On the other hand, a Roth IRA is not taxable income when you take the money out. A traditional IRA is taxable when you take the money out. So pay tax now, pay tax later. You're gonna pay tax at some point. It just depends on which is more critical. So again, if, if you look at the difference between Roth IRA and traditional IRA, the limits are basically the same. Under a Roth, no current deduction. Traditional IRA, current tax deduction. Long-term Roth IRA, no tax at retirement. Traditional IRA, taxable income at retirement. So those are the key factors. So now, which one of those is better for you? Okay, a current tax deduction is certainly more valuable based on the higher tax rate that you're in. So the more money that you make this year, the more benefit a current tax deduction is. If you're in a year that has lower earnings, maybe this is the first year you started your new small business, so your earnings are gonna be lower, then your tax benefit this year is gonna be lower. So the lower your tax rate, the more benefit a Roth IRA is. The higher your current tax rate, the more benefit a traditional IRA is. So that's one good rule of thumb. Now, maybe the biggest thing, and we've already talked about retirement and ages, and we don't get to talk about that too much, but typically, the younger you are, the better the Roth IRA will work for you. The older that you are, the better the traditional IRA will work for you. Now, the concept here is the time value of money. If you're in your early 30s, and you make a contribution to a Roth IRA, all of the earnings on that account from age 30 up until you start taking money out of that account when you're maybe 70, all of those earnings will be tax exempt. You will never pay tax on those. So all of those 40 years of earnings will be the biggest part of your retirement account. So the younger that you are, the better the Roth IRA will most likely work for your retirement plan. The older you are, the closer you are to retirement, maybe you're in your higher earnings years, so now you have a higher current tax deduction and you don't have as long for those earnings to be tax exempt. So the older you are, typically the traditional IRA will work better. Now, as you might guess, the best thing you can do Sit down with a piece of paper, with a pencil, get your calculator, and do some math. Figure out what your current tax rate's gonna be, what that deduction might look like, and that will help you make a decision. That's a great idea to sit down with your investment advisor, your CPA or tax professional, or you can come to NASC and talk to one of our experts about your specific situation. Key point of all, whether you choose a Roth IRA or you choose a traditional IRA, find some money each year to set aside for your own future, and you'll be so glad you did. One thing to always keep in mind, you're not alone.